Okay guys, here we go again. Thank you for coming back to my channel. I put up a video every Monday. And hey, I just wanted to give a shout out to Jim. Jim, thank you for leaving comments down below. I appreciate that. And I appreciate every last one of you guys for coming back every morning, um, Monday morning, and checking my videos out. Thank you. So today, we are going to talk about Teflon pins. Yes, Teflon cookware. And so, yeah, guys, when I remembered, I had this look on my face. Just like that, guys, I did. And I remember a while back about Teflon pans, but all of a sudden, it just hit me. And it was like in the archives of my brain, like, hey, you have to get rid of these Teflon pans, and so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of these pans, throw them out, and get some nice, good pans in here, which I already do have, but, you know, some of you guys probably going through the same thing and have the same look on your face, just like that, and you know you have Teflon pans and know something about it, but somehow it slipped your mind and it got back in the archives of your brain. So here, we're going to talk about it today, so let's go ahead and talk about what is Teflon, okay? So Teflon is a name brand chemical known as PTFE, also PFOA, and also another name for it is C8. And these chemicals can cause cancer according to the American Cancer Society. Um, so um, it can cause breast cancer, prostate cancer, ovarian cancer, you know, it's saying that this chemical is linked to cancer so we shouldn't even have these Teflon pans in our kitchen cooking with those uh, pans so they say if you cook with these pans and you don't reach uh, 570 what 72 Fahrenheit degrees it's okay but who wants to sit there and can and keep taking the temperature of the the, the food that you're cooking to make sure it's okay. Okay, well now it's not over 572 Fahrenheit. It's below. It's okay to eat. No, 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 no. Throw them out, no doubt, right? So anyway, so PTFE is a non-stick material in Teflon, guys. And PFOA is a chemical used in the production of the Teflon. And PFOS is a chemical related to PFOA and C8. All these chemicals can cause real damage to your body and can cause cancer. So that's why we should not use these Teflon pens. Okay, um, and the thing is, DuPont knew about this a while back. They knew about when they introduced this Teflon uh, chemical and it was toxic to the, the workers the employees and it was toxic to the environment too and and uh they have shown that a lot of the livestock around in the area had died because of that and dupont was sued um millions of dollars because of the cancer causing and they knew about this chemical and they said it was safe just like a lot of things that are going on now they're saying that it's safe so guys please yes Look into this. Wake up, guys. Okay. So anyway, so um, let's see. Um, so the better alternatives, guys. There are alternative alternatives that you can choose from from using these non-stick Teflon pans. Okay. So one of them is cast iron. I have a cast iron pan right here, and cast iron is very uh, heavy. But you know, if you keep it greased and stuff and uh, well prepared guys if the food doesn't really stick to carrots um, you just have to put a lot of oil and stuff and i recommend coconut oil but just use your oil and use carrots iron and also we have stainless steel stainless steel is another good alternative to use too instead of this non-stick uh, material stuff um so um also you can just use oil in this too and it won't stick when you know with pans and frying pans and everything like that that's a good alternative and um 100 ceramic cookware guys is good too 100 ceramic cookware and then we have uh the glass uh cookware 
also is good, just plain old glass cookware. And I just want to say too, the microwave, microwave popcorn is very toxic too. It gives out this bad, terrible cancer causing chemicals that we are uh, uh, not aware of. So if you do like we did in the old days, you know, just go ahead and use some popcorn on the stove and, and you put your own butter in there and your seasoning, your salt, that, it's good, it's very good. So go ahead and try that and eliminate yourself from using the microwave and the popcorn. And also too, um, resistant repellent items, like if you use like scotch guard on your sofa and stuff or even on the floor, that also has a lot of chemicals with this P, uh, FOA in it, any type of repellent that's, you know, it just bubbles up and, and it doesn't really cause a stain. They have those harmful chemicals in it. So anyway, just make sure that you pay attention to that, guys, and make sure that um, you do read the labels and make sure that you throw out these harmful chemicals, Teflon pants, bakeware, Get rid of it, guys. It's just really not worth it. And you're probably saying, oh my goodness, there's cancer causing everywhere. But yes, that is true. But if you can prevent something, if you can uh, stop something that you're in control of, why not do it? Like you're in control of your cooking, you're in control of your buying stuff, your, your groceries, you're in control of not buying these type of pans. You're in control, but the environmental thing that you are not in control. So, yes, I can understand that. And you know, I just pray and your higher power, however you know it, that you know one day that they would pay attention to the global warming. They would pay attention to our environment. You know, but the things that you can take control of, why not do it, guys? And let's go ahead and start right now and get it out from the archives, bring it to the front front so that you won't be looking like this right here, like I did. And all of a sudden hit me at once and I said, you know what, I gotta get rid of this. I'm living a full circle healthy life and I need to get rid of these pants and continue striving and control my health and my reach that I can control my own health. The environment, yes guys, we have no control of that. But why not control the things that you can control, you know? So anyway, with that said, guys, I hope you like this video today. So let's go ahead and start going through your, your drawers, your pantry, or whatever, wherever you keep your cookware, your, your bakeware, and let's just get rid of this stuff. Get rid of it and go ahead and try to live a full circle healthy life and um, watch what you're eating, watch what you're cooking on, guys and if you do that you'll be on your way just like i am okay i hope you like my video please like subscribe and keep pumping keep striving and i'll see you in the next video peace out oops i forgot to tell you guys something oops my bad anyway i just want to say right quick um in 2004 3m the chemical company they stopped using that chemical poa pfoa in 2004 in 2013 dupont stopped using that chemical as well in 2015 they started using a chemical called gen x which is also poison and toxin pretty much the same effect so i forgot to tell you guys that so anyway, now you got the scoop. When you're in doubt, throw it out. Peace out, guys. Peace out.